a Chinese AI company called DeepSeek, is now making headlines around the world. Why? Because they're changing the way we build powerful AI systems. For years, big companies like OpenAI spent huge amounts of money. But DeepSeek, they took a smarter path. A new report says DeepSeek is using a low-cost, high-efficiency strategy to train AI. And the results are impressive. While companies like OpenAI spend billions, DeepSeek is getting similar results for just 5 to 10% of the cost. They built their latest models with only 5 to $6 million. Compare that to OpenAI, which spent more than $500 million on GPT-4. DeepSeek uses fewer chips, less electricity, and a much smarter training method. And there's more. Right now, China can't even buy the most powerful AI chips from the US because of export rules. But DeepSeek is showing the world you don't need the best hardware to build powerful AI. Experts say China's AI might be only three to six months behind the top global models. That's got people talking. One US tech advisor, David Sachs, said this proves China is still moving forward, even under pressure. Meanwhile, a startup in the West said, we want to be like deep seek, smart, simple, and efficient. But not everything is smooth. Italy's government is now investigating whether DeepSeek's chatbot gives wrong answers without warning users, and countries like South Korea and Taiwan have paused using DeepSeek tools in government systems due to privacy concerns. Still, the impact is huge. DeepSeek's success has started a price war in China. Even Baidu launched a free AI model after seeing what DeepSeek did. Earlier this year, when DeepSeek released its R1 model, it caused a shockwave across the tech market. Over $1 trillion in value was lost, and Nvidia's stock dropped by 18%. So what does this all mean? DeepSeek isn't just saving money, they're changing the whole idea of how AI is built. They've shown that we don't need the biggest machines or the biggest budgets. What we really need are smart ideas, better plans, and open access. This could be the beginning of a new future where AI is for everyone, not just the richest companies.